Hello, my beauty buddies. I've got my beauty DNA, and this is my October box. And I just wanted to go ahead and share with you what was inside in case you're interested in beauty DNA. It's $25 a month, but they keep on having specials on Rue La La, and I think it was Ideal, and you were able to get three boxes, no, it was four boxes for $15 each. So for like $59 or $60, you're able to subscribe. And then when it ends, they don't even force you into a plan because I ordered it that way. And after the four months, they just invite you to sign up as a regular subscriber. You don't even have to give them your credit card number, which was really, really cool because you know, some of you sign up for things and you forget to unsubscribe and you're like, yeah, I'm glad I did it for that price, but I really don't want to continue on. They don't push you into keeping it. So that's very, very nice. So when you open it up, it's wrapped really nicely. And then they have you know the white fluff underneath. So it looks like this. And then there's a card, which I left somewhere else in my house and I couldn't really find it right now, but it just says why they matched it to you because you have filled out a whole rather, well, I mean, it's like 10 or 15 minutes to fill out, but it's, it's rather in depth. Your likes, your dislikes. Do you want body, face, hair products? Um, if so, which ones do you want? Which fragrances do you like? Which ingredients do you like? What do you dislike? What do you never want to have? So it's very nice. So if you never want a certain type of product, you won't get one. Uh, you normally pay $25 a month, but like I said, there've been deals around lately. So you might want to look into those. And this month I got this hydroxytone AMPM anti-wrinkle complex for day and night use. And it does have broad spectrum SPF 15 sunscreen in it. So I only one time a long time ago got something by hydroxytone. It was some wrinkle freeze thing where you like put it on and held your face still. And it was these little packets and I don't know, I never used them. I don't know what I ever did with them. I should really like give them away, but I, I never used the product because I don't know. I just, it seemed like kind of a pain and I just never did it. So this I was interested in because, um, I've heard some pretty good things. Some people love this brand. Some people don't like it so much. I was reading some reviews about it. Um, but I have to say, I think it's a, overall a very nice overall moisturizer. It's a $69.99 value. Whoops. There goes the lid. And it's really nice. I've used it a few days now and it's a nice, cream. It's rich. It does absorb nicely, but it does have that thicker feeling that I generally do prefer, uh, especially at night, but it absorbs really well. And so I feel hydrated and I think it works nicely. So to give you an idea on Ulta, this got 3.7 out of five stars from people. So what the company says is that they deliver rapid, safe, and long-term visible results. And they said that it helps stimulate the production of collagen. Overall, people thought that it was easy to use. Well, how difficult, right? <laughs> Putting cream on your face when your skin is clean. Always make sure your skin is super clean before you apply anything, right? And then that it improves skin texture, minimalizes wrinkles, and they saw noticeable results and that it was soothing. And the cons on this, they said, was that there were no noticeable results, that it irritated their skin. It didn't irritate mine, but only six people out of, gosh, let's see here. I, I don't know how many people actually, I guess, oh, on 94, six out of 94 said it bothered their, their skin. And five said that it dried out their skin. Five said it was too greasy and four said it had a bad smell, but I don't think it smelled bad at all. I mean, to me, it just smells a lot like sunscreen does. That's not really fragranced. You know what I mean? So, it, you know, it doesn't bother me. It's not a pleasant smell, but it's not an unpleasant smell. It's kind of like a non smell, but there is a fragrance of some sort to it, but I think it's more like a sunscreen type of a fragrance. Now I've got dry skin, so it soaks in really well for me and I like it. So I would definitely give this a thumbs up. It was a good match for me. It's probably not my favorite product I've ever received from them. There was a Dr. Brandt um, cream that I got before that I just was over the moon about, but this is a really good overall everyday moisturizer and it feels high quality and has good, good ingredients in it. So I'm happy with it and just love my beauty DNA. So I keep getting it. Anyhow, if you have any questions, do ask below. I have a whole bunch of other beauty DNA reviews that if you just look through my videos, you will find. And if you've been enjoying my videos, would love if you would subscribe or give the video a thumbs up. And I hope you have a wonderful day or evening wherever you are.